guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Of course, I've got the fire log on as per usual. I did mention that in a, in a, a movie. I make movies. No. I did mention, mention that in a uh, video I made a, a little while ago that you're going to probably hear some crackling noises because in the month of December, um, I here in Canada where I live, Channel and Shaw Cable is our cable company. Channel 165 is the fire log channel. Love it. All right, you guys, we're going to dive into some of these items right here, right now. So I did um, a little collective haul. Um, I went to uh, Rexall, which is a drugstore here in Canada. Also picked up a couple items at Save on Foods, which is a grocery store in, in uh, my area. I went to Sephora and I went to Lush. Now, the Lush, I'll tell you, I got the big, gigantic bag that they give you when you buy lots. But you'll notice I bought very, you're only going to see a couple things because I just picked out my mom and my sister's Christmas present. And now that they just found out that I'm on YouTube, <laughs> I had to come clean because I <laughs> started having family um, finding out that I was on here. So I, I wanted to come clean. So don't want to let them know exactly what they're getting. They know they get Lush every year uh, for me because it's something I enjoy and I love to share that with my mom and my sister. So, um, but they just don't know what they're getting. So I can't show that on here, but know that I did a lot of damage and I was good and pick up just a couple wee little things for myself. So anyway, first off, Rexall. Um, I went to Rexall drugstore here in Canada. Uh, I go there quite often. I talk about my friend Tammy who works at the Rexall drugstore. Uh, super nice lady, love her. Hi, Tammy. Um, so, I will say I picked up these premium square cosmetic pads, uh, luxuriously soft, hypoallergenic, and lint free by the company called Kit, which is, I believe, it to be a Rexall drugs kind of home brand. And these are like there's three across. They're about this this big. And these are sort of like compared to the Shiseido facial pads. I use these, um, I obviously I have Bioderma and I put this on the pad and I take off my first layer of makeup before I cleanse. Um, I haven't tried these before, but I'm really looking forward to it because the price point on these are far better than the ones in the Shiseido. So there's that. All right, so, and then I got an Aussie, called Aussie Awesome Volume Styling Mousse. And the maximum hold out of four, they give it a three. And so it's like this. And I tried it once. I, did, I will say I bought this stuff like over a week ago, so I did try it once. It's quite nice. It's better than the Dove stuff that I had to get rid of. So yeah, really, really loving this very much. So I'm enjoying it. But there's a Paul Mitchell one I can want to try as well. Um, and the last thing I got at Rexall was Tresemme Thermal Creations Heat Protector for your hair. So you spray this on your hair prior. I use it prior to uh, heat styling my hair, whether it's blow drying or straightening, that kind of thing. Uh, briar dye for me, love it. Um, very nice. And then at, at Save On Foods, which is a grocery store nearby, I had like two for, it's not like the best deal. I'm not the best couponer. I wish I was had more time or I was better at it. But um, at Save On Foods, they had these Green Works organic or is it cleaning wipes, and it's an all natural. Green Works is a 99% naturally de derived product. These are wipes. Now, the reason why I'm bringing this up in this video is because I bought these for my bathroom counter because I do my makeup in my bathroom. I don't have a fancy room makeup room or what have you so i do my makeup in my bathroom in the morning when i get ready to go to work so because I'm, there's a lot of powder and the kick up like kick up from my makeup products i tend to tap my brushes before applying um so there's a little bit of powdery eyeshadow face powder whatever into the sink so i really like having these under my sink in the cupboard so i could just wipe down the counters because i'm a, a little ocd a little bit just a little bit so again that was all from rexall all right, so the two Lush products I picked up for myself. I can't go into Lush right now while the season's on without getting one Lord of Miss Rule, at least. My absolute favorite bath bomb right now at Lush. Mm, 
So, and whenever I go to Lush, whether it's for other people or for me, I gotta get one. <laughs> I gotta get at least one of these. So I think that makes seven of these I have in my stash right now because I love it. I got the Lord of Misrule shower gel my last haul and I haven't used it yet because I'm like really OCD. Like, gotta use one at a time. I can't, I can't have like six shower gels at once. I, I can't do that. And then a repurchase, for, but I haven't bought this kind yet this year. This is my first one of this year. I have one left from last year. And this is the So White Bath Bomb. It's all, it's sort of supposed to mimic like a big snowball that you can throw it kind of thing. Like, you know, throw it, don't throw it at anyone. You waste it, it's too, they're expensive. By the way, am I the only one who saw the prices for Lush this year just skyrocketed like more than 20%. Almost a dollar per item, I'm gonna say, that it, it, they went up. But So White is beautiful, not going to harp. I still spent the money. I still love Lush. They know they got me. Um, this smells like apples. It's so gorgeous. So I'm excited to add this one to my collection. And the last place that I went to was Sephora. And red tissue. Loose this time. It's a smaller bag and one thing over tissue looks at least somewhat decent. Cause I don't know if anybody watched that last video that I did the Sephora haul and I had this really big bag and they stuffed this single, what it was is like, they stuffed this single piece of paper in the side of the bag. Like it was just in the side of the bag. And I'm like, well, what's that supposed to do? That was a waste of paper. I would have, I would have, I'd, I'd caught her soon enough. I would have been like, no, save your paper. I'm good. <laughs> like I don't need it. All right, so this is a repurchase for me. I really enjoyed this. I've tried a couple of the masks that Sephora does the sheet masks and this so far is my favorite and it is the perfecting and brightening Sephora pearl mask and as you can see here on the picture it is a sheet mask really nice when I took it off it just felt it, it felt really nice um, moisturizing and illuminating and luminous I think it's probably the best way like that would be a really good mask if like before a Christmas party, like we got a Christmas party, I got a Christmas party that's coming up, I got like three or four, to wear this like, you know, early in the afternoon before you go get ready, before you put your makeup on, get all nice and pampered up and that would be nice. Yeah. All right, so, and I'm sorry, I already tried filming this once before, so I've already had to take this out of a package. I got a Bite Beauty Luminous Cream Lipstick um, and it is, it is for the Movember and what did they call this one? What did they call this one? Sorry. It was for Movember. So today is December 1st. I'm, I'm not posting it today, but yeah, it's called Movember. So, and the thing with Bite Beauty too, if anyone noticed, I've got a, three Bite Beauty lipsticks now and they're all different. Depending on the color range that the lipstick is, they do different cuts of the lipstick on the top for the, the, the lid. Because everyone wears down, when you use lipstick, everyone wears down lipsticks differently and they do that. They do that on purpose, it's so cute. Now, what a great color. I am so excited and I've tried on my hand. I haven't worn it yet, but I'm super excited. This is the Movember that they brought out for um, for the month of November. And, I, and um, proceeds, I think, of this go to um, the Movember uh, charity. And because I bought that, I got this Bite Agave Lip Mask for free. They just threw this in and I thought that was pretty cool. I've heard lots about this brand, or I love Bite Beauty. I mean, I've heard a lot about this product. So I'm really excited to try that. And let me see here. Oh, dear, there's so much stuff. Uh, all right, all right. I got something special. Now, I only know drugstore eyelash curlers. I've heard nothing but great things about Tarte's eyelash curler, and that was in the Isle of Doom. And I found it. Oh my God, look how bejeweled it is. That's just an extra little thing, little pad thing in there. And it's got um, the Lux size sample of the Lights Camera Flashes mascara, which I've never tried. I never bought Highland mascara for myself. I bought some for my sister for her birthday. Look at how jeweled they are. I am so excited to try this and I've had this now for like almost a week. Haven't taken it out of the box. I'm so excited to try it. 
And something else I'm super, I actually went into Sephora looking for black eyeliner because Christmas party is coming up and I want, I wear lashes and I do a, like a cat, um, cat eye liner, but I wanted, um, black eyeliner to go in the upper water line. And I just have a really hard time with transferring of eyeliners from top to bottom. Like I have oily eyelids or whatever, but I saw this now I'm going to show you again, Sephora favorites. Are an amazing way to pick up products I've done a beauty I did a skincare one I did a beauty one like July I picked up the draw the line Sephora favorites uh, eyeliners it's amazing you guys and I haven't tried any of these again I've been waiting so I think I got two full size full size I think from the top to the bottom of, of this here is the Kat Von D tattoo liner and trooper which is black Sephora collection. No, what is this one? Sorry, guys. No, it is Sephora collection. Is the second one. Oh, I'm gonna lose something in here. Uh huh. Um, the Sephora collection is second from the top. Sorry, second from the top. There's Sephora collection Con uh, contour eye pencil in black lace, and then the third one or the one in the right down the center is Smashbox Cosmetics Cole Kajal in Sumar Sumatra. Stila Cosmetics Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner in Stingray. Tarte, second from the bottom right here. The Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Precision Longwear Eyeliner in Black. And the very bottom one is Urban Decay 24-7 hour 24 /7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Vice. You guys, for $36, like Canadian, $36 Canadian, for two full-size products right here, now I know like the Urban Decay one's like a 25, I think it's $25 or something Canadian for this one thing. If I can't do, if I can do nothing but to stress to you all, if you're ever wanting to try stuff out, things like this, like the liner, like I'm not an eyeliner wearer. I barely ever wear eyeliner. You probably never, hardly ever see me wear it on the videos before. But what a great way to try it. Give it a try. There's some purple in here. There was a brown one. Most of them are black, which is what most people will wear for the most part. Um, I'm really, really excited. Yeah, it's purple. It's Sephora one's black. Urban Decay 24-7 is purple. The Kat Von D tattoo liner is black. Tarte liner is black. Stila is black. And Smashbox was brown. Now, I have one last thing before I have to go because it's really getting kind of close. How did this happen? How? I'm Gabby Rouge. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I made VIB Rouge, but one thing I did notice, and I was watching other people's hauls and people saying that they got the VIB Rouge status, and they got a little lipstick from Marc Jacobs, like a red one. I never got that. So when I go to this, I'll probably be going up there this weekend if there are candle sales on this weekend. Um, I'm probably gonna go up there and say, did we get a lipstick? Cause I didn't get that. So, and this of course gives me like free ship, I don't know, free shipping, free or first look at some, so many different things. So concierge service, I have a problem. Not only candles, I love makeup and wash. Oh my gosh. But there are worse things in the world to have problems with. These things I love, these things are wonderful. I'm gonna let you guys go, and thanks for watching. You guys take care.